Yeah, and welcome to part 14 of my Juice X Human Revolution Give Me Juice X difficulty playthrough, which is the hardest difficulty, of course. Um, I think it would be too easy on anything else. You gotta, you gotta pump it up. So we are uh, at the Singapore, Singapore facility. Let's load on in. Uh, slow this one. When Burke indicated a base-wide lockdown, initiated base-wide lockdown, started flooding the prison cells and research lab with gas, Jensen had to make a difficult choice. Save the prison or save Kavanaugh. Gen Gen Jensen chose the prisoners, despite Kavanaugh's... something, something, whistleblower, something, something. I would assume. Ah, that's right. Hang on. Let me just fix the camera up slightly. So you can see everything there. Beautiful. Beautiful. Whenever I tab out and tab back in with this, it has my head facing upwards for whatever reason. Now, we are at the ranch. We are at the ranch. And we have cleared... Cleared all of this. We do it down there. We cleared all of this. Cleared that. And cleared the, the top level as well, so... All of this has been worked through, it's all done, and we're heading down this way. This is the, the way forward, clearly. We need to currently upload a virus to the security computer and enter the restricted area. Megan is being held in a separate, heavily guarded section of this facility. Far uh, Faraday, Colvin, and Koss have a plan that will help me reach her, but first I need to disable Beltow's ability to track their GPLs. Silly Sevchenko's computer virus should do the trick once I upload it to the central security computer. Yeah, Sevili, Sevili Sevchenko, Vasily, not Sevili, Vasily Sevchenko, giving us, giving us the help from the grave. G'day Tangle12, welcome into the stream. Now, I kind of can't remember, did we destroy the robot that was here? I think we did. Inventory of grenades, I think we're, I think we're good. We've got five frags, five EMPs, two gas, three... Three, uh, what are they called? Duns. I mean, let's let's be on frag, shall we? They're the most explosive. Uh, we have a security cam here. Well, that's gonna be pretty easy to get past, I would assume. Is there any, um, there's not a security bot here. Hello? Imagine if I shoot that camera, that security bus can activate, which I really couldn't care less about. I mean, I'll just blow it up, but... Is there really not another way? I need to put the bins out, Tetra etc. Welcome into the stream. Something beeping. Sounds like a, a grenade of some sorts. Or could we just like F1 was cloak, wasn't it? Easy. Microwave is beeping. Go get the dinner. <laughs> No, no, something else was beeping. It was not the microwave. Oh, oh, really? No. no we gotta activate this, uh, this bot. We can blow it up. I don't have space. You mean I'm actually full? I mean, we can, we can fix that pretty easily. Um, what's our health at? Uh, actually full. Here we go. Here we go. <laughs> Fixed. Let's shut that door so no one gets a little look see in here. So upload the virus there, but we're wanna do other things first. Nothing else in here? No weak walls. No, nothing? 
Oh, no, no vents. Actually, just a, uh, just a room. Security rating three. <laughs> uh, tunnel hub. Yeah. Tunnel hub. It's going to be like a tunnel pathway. Oh my goodness. Um. Okay. Yeah, we're good. Access granted. Nice, nice. Uh, cameras, thank you. Ah, uh, robots, yeah. Like, just come on out so I can destroy you, right? Let's turn the robot on. <laughs> Any in it? Nothing. Oh. Forty five XP. <laughs> you know it. You know it. <laughs> I'll do it for 45 XP. Alright. Card reader. Let's do it. Uh, cancel computer interaction without uploading that virus? No, upload Vasily's virus. Let's go. Pritchard, are you still tracking the scientists? Of course. Simulate feedback along that route. Make it strong enough to vibrate their implants. They have to feel it. A signal, eh? Not bad, Jensen. I'm sending it now. Nice. Find Megan Reed. I mean, I want to kill these guys, right? I mean, we're not letting them get through. The the grenade could have been better, I will admit, but you know. <laughs> Pretty bad grenade. I, mean, I just should have shot them as they as they came around the corner here, right? That would have been the smarter play. Oh, that didn't like open up any rooms in here or anything. Let's just have a quick check. Nothing opened up. No. Righto. Find Megan Reed. That the scientist plan worked. The door to the restricted area is now open. Time to get inside to find Megan. I mean, if that's all we did, this the um the uh what's it called the distraction for was to was to get three guards out of the way i mean come on <laughs> target seeking system that's for this one i think i think we've already got that right hush sound laser target seeking yeah fletch it navigation system Pew pew. Yeah, man. I'm the king of the pew pews. Heavy rifle. Don't need that. I mean, sure. Ammunition. I'll take it. Fletchets are hacks. Uh, yeah. Do you know what the Fletchit system is? <laughs> yeah. When it's activated, 
You don't even need to be aiming around the corner. I could just like it, it locks on and I just fire around the corner without showing myself and they and they zero in. <laughs> it's it's a little bit BS. Uh, I don't think they deal as much damage though. I think they just hit like center of target, so they never headshot, basically. Um Yeah, they never headshot. They're like secret rooms here. Feels like there'd be a place where there'd be a secret room, you know? Yeah, I get that secret room vibe. I don't think so. Right. I don't want I don't want Fletcher Son. Prefer to shoot myself. That didn't that didn't come out right. I prefer to shoot myself. <laughs> uh I see. not recommend shooting oneself. See security bots. Hmm. This deals boss fighty. Let's just let's just throw a save in, like a proper save. Your tenacity, Adam Jensen, is really quite irritating. We'd like you to stop now. I'm afraid I can't, so. You see, I figured it out. Feels like a room I of know nope. what you and your conspiracy buddies are planning. Do you? How clever. A new biochip. A software upgrade that limits what augmentations can do. You're creating a kill switch. You kidnap Megan Reed's team to do it, and you're seizing control of the market to ensure it gets distributed. All because you're afraid of people like me. Augmented people, with the power to resist you. No one's afraid of you, Mr. Jensen. All your blundering around and childish interference hasn't stopped a thing. Tell me, have you been to a limb clinic lately? Let me guess. That was supposed to shut me down, right? Leave me broken and begging? The Orgs were recalled! You should be offline! <laughs> Women never fail to underestimate men. Oh, gee. You should have stayed dead, Jensen. Oh, shit. Rematch time. Fucking rematch time. This guy's a whole a whole pile of raw. Do you realize how hopeless this is? You Oh, what? I just get one shot by a grenade? Okay. <laughs> just get one shot by a grenade. Sure. I mean, yeah. And I guess if it lands right on top of me, that makes sense. Um, <laughs> question is, how do you... Oh, okay, we gotta, we'll, we'll skip, we'll skip. You did just jump on top of me. I tried to jump away from it. Alright, righto. Let's go. Can we skip this? There's a skip button. Yep, skip. Right there. Do you realize how hopeless this is? You. How can a man be so clueless, so blocked? Whoa. I thought you would be more formidable than this. What? I'm right over here. Come here. How does it feel, Jensen? 
knowing you'll die without finding the truth. Look at you, jumping at shadows like a scared child. Yeah, that's right. Get that, India. Didn't even have to use any Python ammo. Finish it. Not until you tell me where Megan is. You've lost her, Jensen. Men like us. Wow, poetic. I mean, one grenade into death. He was he was easy enough. A little bit of ammunition. Plasma rifle. Did we have a plasma rifle before? I think we did. And we had the laser rifle. I don't think we had a plasma rifle. Not that I have space for it, but sure. We'll take the ammunition for now. Um, now, I did notice in amongst that, yeah, that these boxes have, have stuff in them. These are actually like... Weapons caches or something? Sure. You can activate the security bots if you want. I mean, I guess that would be a lot harder if you lost all your augmentations because, like, the, the chick clicked you offline. Uh, but... Yeah, I guess without being clicked offline, not too bad. Nope. Nope. Sure. As if, like, you don't have enough ammo to take him down. My goodness. Like, guns and... guns and shit everywhere. Peps. <laughs> As if you'd use a peps. A stun gun. This is the fucking meme. The meme corner right here. This is the meme corner. Yeah. You open up the, the weapons cache to find a stun gun. <laughs> Bloody useless. <laughs> uh, <laughs> that'd be actually pretty funny. Uh, so all these areas, this is all cleared out. We've done the lower floor. We get up. Heavy rifle. Oh, this is like actual um empty. Oh, what a debate. What's this room at? Like a secret oh, hello. This is where you're meant to come in the fight and like you can get away, you can hide in the in the ventilation shaft or something. Huh. Fair enough. I guess we'll check out the where that goes in a second. Just check the rest of these. I guess that just gets you through that uh that door. Cushion mine. I don't need mines. Fragmentation mine. It says an automatic dock lock opener thing, so you can get through that lock straight away. Ah, I see it. Ah, I see it. There's like multiple ways you could take this boss fight if you want to. Hey you, how are you going? Uh okay, it's Vodsky. I'm doing well, man. I've just uh we just killed Namir. He's lying on the floor over there. Let me give you the close up view. Hang on. Uh where are we? This one. Here he is. He's he's dead. He's dead. 
Um, <laughs> yeah, he, he didn't last very long. We did die once to a stray uh, grenade, which just one-shot us. We just one-shot to a single grenade. So that was fun. Um, but, you know, apart from that... Oh, you can't even, like, hack this... Oh, you can. Had Tetra Acceptor's job go after the whole crash? Strong nade, techies might... It was, man. It was, it was an ulti. Access grant. Fuck. Camera wants to try and see me. Fixed the site, made it not as reliant on silly government website. Nice. Nice. I mean, <laughs> I like how you put that. Silly government website. That box was just floating in me there, by the way. I don't know if you guys saw that, but there was a... The box just was, was mid-float. Um... First aid? What? I've never seen that the entire game. Is that actually, like... Does that heal you if you come and stand in next to it? I don't know. With. There's the ventilation shaft. Oh, here it is. Here. So this just takes you back around to this other room. Are there any alternate paths? Nope. Flying box. Hell yeah, I saw it, man. Yeah, it was there, man. I was like, there's a flying box there. So this is the the post boss fight. Uh, you know, looting, <laughs> scouting all the places I could have gone in the boss fight. Rough day at work today, difficult customer, or moral question. Uh, is, this a, is this a multiple choice quiz? Do I take rough customer story or moral dilemma story? Is that, is that what you're saying? Access granted. No, they're the same. Uh, yeah, let's bring let's bring the robots out. I want to I want to kill them. I want to see what's in their areas. But we're literally turning on enemies for ourselves here. We're making we're making more enemies. It wasn't hard enough, so we're spicing up a bit. This is this, let's just save. <laughs> this is where I die. Turning on more enemies just for lols. Bits and giggles. I'm here, Mr. Alright, could be a multiple choice question. Hang on, let me just kill this. Let me just kill that. Alright, alright, we're, we're, we're in the clear again. Uh, okay. Okay, could be a multi-twist question too, because I had two difficult customers, but only one had a moral dilemma. To bill or not to bill a child, 17-year-old. Mr. Robot, Boston Dynamics bot dead. <laughs> I actually got, I got that, I got that joke. To bill or not to bill a 17-year-old? I mean, well, what's, what's the company, um, this is where I walked in. What's the company standing on it? Like, that's, that's what my first question would be, you know? Um, I mean, a question like that shouldn't be a moral question. That should just be um, a, like, you follow a procedure, right? There's a procedure you follow.
Like, that's why there's a boss. You know, bosses are... Uh, are paid to... Make decisions like that. Ooh, I found a wall. You know I did. What is this? Is this another... It's a laser rifle? We, we, we used one of them before. That was shit. I mean, I don't know why it's guarded like that. I'd, I'd literally rather have a pistol. They are not good at all. Gas canister? What happens? I put this here. And I put this here. And then I blow them up together. Okay. We're quite flexible and mostly check things for every situation. Yeah, I asked my boss. Haven't got a response yet. Nothing will happen. I mean, it's an explosion and a gas explosion in one. That doesn't sound like nothing to me. And did it turn it off? Nah, it didn't. That feels bad. I mean, I know, you, I know you're keen for explosions. I mean, it, something happened. I'm keen for destruction. Okay, I'll give you some... Yeah. Yeah, it's just laser off. There's nothing else up there. Oh, are you fucking kidding me? No fucking way. Hang on. Hang on. Okay, yeah, I feel like that's... So you meant to break down this door here. You meant to break down this wall, and then you can like get it from above. But there's a laser grid. <laughs> you need a box, hey! Don't don't diss the boxes, man. Boxes are our bread and butter. They they make us who we are. So, hold on. So yeah, you could drop down. Okay. I mean, there's... The, you just drop down into it. But then what do you do? You're in there. You can't get out. That seems sus. Um, so, hang on. Where's this go? Just down. Just down, lol. Never get tired of that animation, by the way. Hey, okay, I think we're, I think we're good. I think we've cleared the. I think we've cleared the area. Um. Righto, time to move forward. Find Megan. I think we're. I think we're about to find Megan. I think this was the last barrier on the way to Megan. Our our long trek is going to come finally to an end. Box. See a box. I get I, I'm like a box magnet, man. Okay. We, all of a sudden, the color scheme has changed dramatically. Okay, this is actually super cool. Uh, from a gameplay gameplay perspective, the entire game has been like yellowy golds, right? Yellowy golds on black. That's been the entire game, right? Yellowy golds on black. That's like been the aesthetic of the of the like the graphics the entire game. Then, I walk through here. Yeah, like the UI, right? So the whole the whole game is like yellowy golds. And then I come into this area and it is like white. It's white. White and black. It's like a completely different aesthetic. That's, that's actually super cool. Oh, here we go. <gasps> Jaren, is that you? Megan, we found exactly. her. Adam? Oh my god, Adam, it's you. You're hurt. What happened? What happened to you? 
I risked my life for you, Megan. I came halfway around the world, and for what? It's not what you think. Are you part of this? No! No, Adam, I swear it! The kidnapping was real. The attack on Seraph Industries, they came after me. They wanted my research. And when did you decide they could have it? It didn't happen like that. I wanted to tell you, but I couldn't. I couldn't! And then David said we had to use it. We owed it to mankind. David, what are you talking about? My great discovery. The genetic framework I found that makes it easier for living tissue to bond with implants. I found it. In you, Adam. I used your DNA. I wanted to tell you, I swear. But David convinced me what it could mean for mankind. How much better off we could all be. It took Hugh to make me see how wrong I was. Hugh? Hugh Darrow. He owns this facility. After Namir brought us here... Richard! Patch me into Seraph, now! Adam, please! He was only pretending to work with Tai Young and the others. He found out what they were planning to do and told them he would help. But only to make sure they never succeeded. Their control signal won't work. Thank you, David. Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Seraph here has asked me to show the world how human enhancement technology can change it. After careful deliberation, I've decided I must do exactly that. Forgive me. Oh god. He's modified the control signal. Anyone with the new biochip will be affected. You never said anything about this. I'm going back for the scientists. No, Adam! I know the complex better than you. I'll find them. There's a hangar bay through there. Get to its control room and retract the roof. Clear a path for us. Now, that was the plan. Something where they went very much to plan or against it. No, that was the plan. That was the plan all along to modify the, the biochips so that the it showed the what human enhancement technology could do. So they're gonna get everyone against it, basically. Right, so they want us to run quickly. I mean, look at this room. We just talked about aesthetics. Look at this room. Um, we're, not, we're not going anywhere in a hurry. I don't care how much the music soundtrack is trying to hurry me along. You know, fuck you, music soundtrack. I'm staying in this room and I'm investigating. Then I just run away after I find the, like, the end game room. Let's hack this. What do we got? That's right. Hacking music overrides must must run faster music. Oh, well, my hacking software is so high now. This it's not even fair. <laughs> it's not even fair. Okay. Ebook. Reimagining retinal implants just a so it's like another scholar. That must be like a one of the last scholars you can get. Nothing too important. Also, you did Optus. Uh, no, no, I have no hacking abilities in real life. Uh, Bro, if you're gonna sit somewhere, sit up on the bloody comfortable seat, eh? No, no, not the fucking grenade. <laughs> Misclick. It's okay. Uh, come up here. Come up here. Hang on. I got. I got. I got. I got, to, I got to get this guy up on the seat. Get up here. Get up here. Come on. Oh. 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 Oh no. Oh well. Um. This this is this is awkward, isn't it? Get come over here. Come over here. Get over here. Yeah, 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 yeah. There we go. There we go. Oh, he's reading a book. There we go. He's reading a book. He's relaxing. He's got his Lego crossed over the back. 
Um, oh, I, to get the crash test dummy up in a comfortable position, man. Um, it's good. It's good. He's fine now. I can just leave him there. He's playing music. Okay. Hey, I'm like going over every inch of this room, eh? Just to make sure there's nothing here. Alright, let's come over to this area. There we have ebook. Down to cases. Hudaro's final interview. Hudaro, the fact is Eliza, the last few years have taught us very valuable lessons. I understand you've had some controversial things to say about augmentation technology. I've ruffled some feathers to be sure, but I had but I have that right. That technology wouldn't exist without you. Look, the fact is, what's the, that bloody Einstein quote about the A-bomb? If only I had known, I should have become a, witch, a watchmaker. Yes, that's the one. I know what he meant. These days I'm thinking we went too far. I'm wondering about putting the genie back in the bottle. Is that possible? Everything is possible. Having the ability to transcend our limits is one thing. We're racing uncontrolled towards some blind singularity. We're in danger of becoming two species. Those empowered and those left behind. That's it. He was he put the genie back in the bottle. Who you darrow? Make everyone go crazy who's got implants. Putting the genie back in the bottle. Dude, I'm not fantasizing about the doll. I just wanted the doll the, the crash test dummy is its name to be comfortable. It, look, now he's comfortable. It looks like he's actually just chilling that quick. I can get him a book. I just give him a book now to, to have him read. Uh computer, security rating five. This is Hugh Darrow's computer. Ho ho ho. Let's Let's have a little look see. Just put these sideways pathings. Yeah, stop going, bro. Deal with it. Access granted. Nice. Good morning, Mr. Darrow. Alan Curtis, Versa Life. Regarding the conversation we had last week, the project advancing quite swiftly, we managed to devise a new and improved prototype to better counter the quantum size effect. So far the nano ionics are responding as planned and the latent effects on biomaterials are ne neg negligible. An unforeseen benefit is that using copper couplings make the units virtually in undetectable. This will, on the other hand, require a very potent electronic virtual tracking system for maintenance and emergency procedures. We've been able to build and modify molecular structures on the fly using mechanosynthesis. The samples will respond very well, apart from the usual rejection syndrome, of course, it always sets in order sets in after a few minutes. The effects are even more potent on the molecular level. That's why the news from some of the associates are so promising. Apparently they're on the verge of us isolating replicating DNA segments that present no rejection syndrome whatsoever. I don't know how you and your team got access to those samples, but I don't care. That's me. I'm the samples. Do you realize what this could mean? We're finally there. Imagine that, a regular looking human being, nothing unnatural in his appearance, and still the power of billions of machines within him, manipulated at will. This is the future, Mr. Darrow. That's the original Juice X game. That's where it leads to. I love the little hint. So if you played the original, the game of the year edition, Juice X, um, that's, this is, this is like a little, a little nod to that. Because, of course, this was made after the original. So, that's like a little nod to the original. Because, of course, in that you are... You have nano nanobots. Um, it's all nano nanorobotics. It's still human augmentation, but it's... Nano what are you doing? No, you were like the dude in the apartment that I opened the secret door with. Can I click you? No, I can't. Oh, they're teasing you. They're teasing the little completionist like me. <laughs> I said it once, okay? I'm not doing it again. I did, I did it once. Yes, it is a difficult word to pronounce. I think I think we've cleared the room. So this way was the way we came, yeah? Can we have some... Um, painkillers? Where are the painkillers at? What I'll do. Elevator. Jensen, what the hell's going on out there? Broadcast frequencies are going haywire. Malik, is that you? Where are you? 
Coming into visual range of Singapore now. Been in the air since Pritchard first pinged you. Good timing. I'm heading for a hangar bay to open the roof. I'll need an emergency extraction. Roger that. I'm on my way. What if she died? What if she died? Because I saved her. What if she died? Oh, you, you, you guys are, you guys are gone, eh? Oh, they're all affected. Look, they're all shut down. They're all hitting their heads. No, I mean, the dude, she can die. I saved her, but now she's in the story later on. Hey, Jensen. Looks like you could use some help. Not really. I mean, I'm, I'm good. I see the scientist, Jensen. I'm landing nearby. Uh, let me open the damn I, door. I Dr. Reed wants to speak to you. Hang on. Yeah, so I can't speak to her myself. Frida, yeah, Frida could have died. I saved her in in Chang in Hangsha. Hello, Adam. We're all fine, but you have to get to Panchea and stop Hugh. You and I aren't done with this, Megan. I know how it looks, but you have to stop the broadcast. I think it's causing the new biochips to overstimulate the vagus nerve, creating terrifying hallucinations. You mean it's driving augmented people insane? Yes. And it's up to you to stop it. Use the Leo shuttle. It will take you to Panchea. Good luck, Adam. Fuck, use the Leo shuttle? No. Box? Oh, <laughs> I'm the box king. I, I This is why I move every box. Traveler. What do we got? Killing system, no, I don't need that. Security rating 5 computer. M stain? Who's that? Oh my goodness. Uh, okay, where are we gonna get to? We just gotta, we just gotta go fast. They're all level fives. Oh my god, we're gonna get roasted. Yeah, okay, let's immediately stop worm. Uh, we're gonna use lots of stop worms apparently. Nuke. Nuke. Access granted. Whew. All right. <laughs> we, just, we just nuke our way there. Hangar 18. Dave 2. I just received this communication from Fortress Zero. Check some message digest. MD2, MD4, MD5. Script form. Translation follows. Breaker 9 begins. Subject witness. Prognosis seen too much. Site 18 hangar. Inventory. Foreign life forms. State suspended cryogenics. Risk nominal. Solution selective amnesia. Bravo kilo actual. End transmission. The curtain is failing. Soon they'll know too much. I know too much. Dave 1. Holy shit. Yeah, so this is this is now just throwing conspiracy theories at you left, right, and center now. Cooling system, no, I don't need that. Um, so there's someone in 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 stasis. I get through here. You need the cooling system. No, I don't. Too hot to handle. Oh, oh. Oh, let me just fan myself. Oh, it's Vodka. You make me blush. Um, <laughs> okay, so let's check up on here first. Oh, they're dead? They actually just got, like, nuked. He's got something. I mean, it was just a an EMP. I guess, I guess if their circuits are fried, then the circuits are fried, right?
Right, okay, so we've checked the... up here. Let's go down. Always look up. Always look up in these games. Make sure there's nothing you've missed. Always look down. Up and down are the two places people don't look. Okay. Even, even in real life. In games they don't, because in real life they don't either. People don't look up or down. This is why in supermarkets they always place like all of the um all of the can't move these all of like the expensive stuff on the eye level shelf and all of like the the discount wares are on like the like the lower shelf or the or the higher shelf people don't look up and down man people look side to side because that's that's um that's eye level I gotta get underneath there as well. The layout planning. Of this room? Side to side? I don't know. There's so much research for it. Grocery stores. <laughs> yeah. I missed, I literally missed one message in all of that. Like I caught like five, five of them and I missed the one message that you mentioned grocery stores. And I'm like, what? <laughs> What's he talking about? This room? No. Right, nothing under here either. All right. Just the bait room. It's like, yeah, surely there'll be something in here, right? There's high tension music. There's going to be something in here. No. Nah, absolutely nothing. Nothing of note. Oh, I, I feel a cutscene coming on. I feel a cutscene coming on. Over here. Nothing. Chess drama has evolved. What is this? Hey. Right. This looks like a shuttle. The Leo shuttle. It's actually the Leos shuttle. Or Leo shuttle. Now you have to have an apostrophe it was Leo's. That that's Leos. She called it the Leo shuttle. The Leos shuttle. Where's the where's the go button? I wanna fall down there. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I found I found the go button. It's clearly the Leos. That's right, it is. I mean, the lady didn't know what she's... She's been imprisoned here for six months, and she doesn't even know the name of the bloody shuttle. Like, come on, man. Get get on the right level. I think, we're, I think we're good to go. We're leaving this place. We've done all our objectives. Yep. Use the Leo shuttle. To reach Pangea. Dara's broadcasting signal from Pangea. The same Pangea where Sarah for most of the world leaders are gathered. I have to get there and shut off that signal, and the fastest way to do it is by using Darrow's suborbital shuttle. Lethal energy opportunity shuttle. I guess it's I guess the S stands for shuttle. I guess the S stands for shuttle, but that's not clear. Because it should say Leo shuttle, not Leo S. I'm gonna call it the Leos. Righto, Leos. Let's go. Automated systems. Oh fuck online. yeah, let's go. Darrow sequence one. Code one. One A. Preset and ready to engage. Suborbital trajectory plotted. Destination, Panchea. Begin countdown, Mr. Darrow. Fuck yeah, let's go. Begin countdown. Code, zero, zero, zero. Confirm, zero. Countdown. <laughs> Code, zero, zero, zero. Nice. Quality stuff. Oh, here we go. Fuck, we're launching. We're fucking launching, man. You wanted some boom? This is a big boomstick. We're in the boomstick this time. Ready. We gotta hold on. Ready? Strap in. Fucking hell, let's go. Here we go.
The G's are too much. They're pulling on us. Oh, shoot failure? That's not good. Yeah, I can find all the G's. <laughs> I can... Man, we, 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 were sh we, were, we were shaking so much in the shuttle, the, head, the headset came off. <laughs> it was powerful stuff. Okay. We fucking arrived. This is where everyone was going crazy. Great Britain. Jensen. Oh shit, that's loud. Jensen, can you read me? Barely. I've reached Panchea, Pritchard. Any word from Sarah for the UN delegates? Nothing. The installation went into lockdown shortly after Darrow gave his speech. I can't tell if anyone's even alive. And the signal's still broadcasting. Meaning no one's safe till I get in there and shut it down. You'll have to disengage the lockdown first. Look for a master control panel at the top of the tower. That's where we're going. We're going to the top of the tower. Shit. With a whole bunch of crazed people hallucinating on the way. Right. I see how it is. I mean, it looks like people went a little bit wild here. Take the chopper. Uh... You know what? It's not a bad idea. I think the chopper is in lockdown. Yeah, it's flashing. We can't use it. We can't use it. It's it's in lockdown. Uh, nice little panoramic panoramic views here. Righto, let's go, lads. Mount up. Telling me that I can't hack it? No, no, the flashing red light means that's a no. Where's our map at? We gotta look at what we're looking at here. Okay, so we just got a big area here. We got stairs. Okay, so we just, we're gonna have to scout this area. You like the the sounds? Like the metal, the metal like, um, like uh, tensing, stretching or whatever. Like, uh, it's like, Horror movie sounds basically. Can I get up there? Oh, you know I want to get up there. Oh, you know I can get up there, right? Oh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get up there. I'll find a box. <laughs> Disturbing, but I like it. Uh, there's a box here. I can't pick it up. Anything behind here? Now, let, now we learn our lesson in um, in in shipping containers. Let's just save and back out of there. Uh, we learn our lesson in shipping containers. Not all shipping containers are meant to be explored, you know. Uh, I'm guessing that one's not. We found a box there. We have a box here. We have a couple of boxes. Okay. So we have three boxes we can use. It's box filled, man. We can get everywhere now. I mean, remember, that was when we didn't have all our orcs, remember? Mate, we are we are kitted at the moment, so we can we can easily get in. Boss calling? Sure man, sure man. We can easily get in and around. Nothing. Okay. We get the feeling there might be something out here with all these cargo boxes. to be anything there. Boxes down here, though. Oh, ow. 
Okay, don't run the boxes into the fire. They explode. Lesson learnt. Okay. So we're sort of slowly clearing... The areas. Sort of side to side. Here. Funny. Painkillers. Eventually something for all our... All our looking. Okay, so... That actually looks like it's going to go somewhere. Um, no... No kappa. Looks like he's actually going somewhere. Yeah. Hacking software, I'll take it. So we'll, we'll, we'll climb up there soon. We'll just keep clearing the, the ground floor, basically. <laughs> uh, any open doors on this side? Not up there, but we'll, we'll see that soon enough. We have a down here. That looks like a way in. It looks like we have a couple of ways in, I reckon. Yeah. So I think we I think we got a couple of ways in. But we'll just keep exploring out here first. Okay, is it soft soft lock there? I can't get through. Nothing here, was there? Okay, we checked that one out. Okay, just these ones left here. Don't think there's anything in there. Right. So we looks like we have two entry points, but we don't. We want to explore up these up here first. Like this is going to be one of the entry points that would appear. Eps energy pack, laser. Oh, here we go. That's what we want. That's the juice. See it. Uh, how can I not fit a gas grenade? I'm definitely going to want a gas grenade. This thing probably. Go for now. Let's take that. 
Alright. Okay. So we have two entry points. Would appear down there or up here. Now, I personally like to take the high ground. Um, I'm a, I'm a, you know, I've, I've learnt from Obi Wan Kenobi. Take the high ground. I wonder if I can actually get on top of. I didn't ever try, did I? Oh shit, didn't make the jump. Uh, I've done parkour here at the moment. I mean, I don't think there's anything on top of them, right? It may even be hard coded that I can't get up there, but you know, I am the sort of guy who's got to know. I just have to know. the best spot to get up. Actually, can you just... How close is it over there? Ah. I don't think... I don't think there's anything up there anyway. Oh, I want to see. Uh, let's let's go over here. Work. We're boxing. You're back. We've discovered we have an entry point all the way up there. And we have an entry, an underground entry point. Now the underground entry point looks sketch as, as sketch as fuck. Like, let's be honest, it, it looks super, super sketchy. Uh, but we're just currently boxing, just unboxing, to see if we can in fact get up on top of this. Because we certainly don't like to leave any box left unturned. Okay. Oh. Yeah. yeah, that's how we do it. Okay. All right. Can. Now the fact that you can get up here makes me wonder, you know? Makes me just wonder a little bit. Now if I jump, it's just going to put me back down. Can't make that jump anyway, even if even if it was interactable. Okay. Nothing there. Anything down here? I mean, is this just put up here to troll people like me? Quite possibly. Quite possibly. Like we're gonna make it act. We're gonna make it so people can actually get up here, and then there's there's nothing there. Nothing that way. Nah. Nothing. Oh well. 
you actually check that out? I can't remember. I feel like I don't remember going into there. No, I don't think we did, actually. Plasma rifle, yeah. We, we don't care for the plasma rifle. It's fine. Alright. I think we're good. I think we have fully cleared the outside area. Alright, and now because we're Obi-Wan Kenobi enjoyers, we're going for the high ground instead of the low ground. Because I've seen what happens to people in situations like this when they when they go into the in the underground tunnel, you know. I know what happens. I've seen I, I I've read the Hunger Games. I've seen the movies. Really, did I just fall down? Um, you don't you don't want to you don't want to go in the sewers, man. Pathfinder, 300. Feels good, man. Uh, I think we get the guns back out. Because we're now inside the lockdown zone. Here, a robot, so let's get the EMP out. EPM gets the EMP. So many times people see my name and uh, and just say <laughs> EPM, do uh, EMP Dota, you know. You don't know how many see my name and say it's vodka? <laughs> yeah. I I uh I purposefully make myself say vodster. <laughs> I don't even know if I've got it right. What is it? A rocket launcher? This guy had this guy was you. This was you. This is you. This is you, man. This was you. You're trying to hide up here. Uh, you're trying to like evade the the mass chaos downstairs, and then someone snuck up from behind and just whacked you. Or even worse, you shot someone close range with the rocket launcher and um and you know blew blew yourself up. But I'm gonna give you a uh, a fair burial. Uh, there you go. Dikes. Wouldn't look that good if I shot someone close range. Maybe not. And where the hell are we going? What's our map at? What are we looking at here? Is this just going to take us down? Where the hell am I? I don't like down. I, I sort of like being a, a higher than everyone, you know? Yeah, it's at that level. We're, at, we're down base level. But something I might do anyway. Yeah, it'd be, I mean, it'd be a good way to go, right? Assuming you, you insta-killed yourself. You, you wouldn't want to be surviving, you know? In blood, man. The fuck, where's this map at? What the hell? What am I looking at? Why is this map? Oh, this is like a sub level. Okay, I see it. Okay, so this is back up here now. Okay, so we're just down on this level. The fuck is this? There's another vent there. Okay. Um, 
there appears to be many, many places for me to go. Pritchard, Francia's broadcast center is at the base of the station near the bottom of the ocean. Is that right? But the lockdown caused all the blast doors to seal. You won't be able to go down until you override the manually. From up in the tower. I got it. So that's the way down. So that's where we're going to go. Okay, so that's the way down. Got it. We can't go that way yet. Go down there. But what's this vent at? Oh, sorry. What? Like a freaking mini puzzle or some shit? How do I... I just go through the gap. What? So now down on the base level. Fuck me, man. Don't, I don't like... I don't like the scary shit, eh? I mean, I, mean, I know this isn't scary at all, but... I'm, uh... The music, eh? Music is such a... Such an absolute killer. Like, there's probably nothing out there. Nah, I'm not... I'm not scared. I mean, I'm... I am... I've got... I've got the... The goods. Uh... Another vent? Okay, so that was down there. Ah, uh, you don't. That's the short answer to that. Uh, right, so this is this way. Was it your Steam? Uh, yeah, it, it was my Steam. <laughs> yeah, yeah, my Steam. <laughs> okay, got some grenades here. We can come back for it, looks like. Oh, is this the robot here? Is it packed up? The robot is packed. Why are there all these vents here? Like vents that are going nowhere. <laughs> no. No. I'm not a I'm not a horror enjoyer at all. That's the one thing I'll never do. I wouldn't even do it off stream. I mean I'm just not a I'm just not that sort of person. Pyron? Pyron project, Penchea Oceanic Installation 5 online, emergency situation detected. We, us, have detected major power fluctuations, pressure and stabilizers, outages, malfunctions across wide areas of Oceanic Station. Repeated alert warnings remain unattended. Situation approaching critical. Advise, advise, advise. Analysis suggests immediate activation of emergency lockdown procedure 999 is necessary. Commencing full station lockdown in 5432. Emergency override protocols activate. Disengage lockdown procedure main how and use manual override. 747736. Iron Alpha Pod, have a nice day. This is not a test. Security teams have been notified and mobilized. Please remount your workstations. 
I see it, mummy. The fuck? I was at the doctor to get some blood work done. Yeah. What's uh? What's the? What's the verdict? Access grant. Did it today. I kind of want to destroy this robot. That's that's two fifty XP right there, man. Two fifty XP feels good, man. Let's turn it on. I've got a grenade over here. Feels bad, man, for the robot. Yeah, just turned him on to be to be killed. Yeah. Oh, there's two. Oh, we're definitely getting those. Uh, what are we dropping for that? Uh, gas can. This this can probably go. Actually, is that the one? Yeah, that can that can probably go. We don't need five. We have five typhoons plenty. That's good. I prefer grenades. Because Typhoon, you gotta be right next to something to use it. Alright, so we haven't explored this side yet. Um, how do we get across to there? There's a stairwell. Over here, nice. Okay, so that's a way out. Ah, that's the way forward. Okay, so we've located the way forward, which means we now have to go back. You know how it is? Once you locate the way forward, that's the direction you don't go ammo capacity. I don't think anything needs ammo capacity. That's the one we, we don't need, is it? Yeah, that's full. That's definitely full. I'm pretty sure this one's full. Yeah, ammo capacity is the one we just don't need. They always give you so many ammo. I, I think I've turned down like, like five or six ammo capacities now, like six or seven even. That's the one you never need. Right, so we've cleared this area up and down. But now we gotta go back to the way we could have come, I guess, through the other, like the downstairs vent. This could have been the other way if you didn't find the jumpy over the boxes. We are back, poopy time. Sure, man. Man, I'm gonna stop you. The hell are we? Helipad? Oh, right. So that's that's back outside. Okay, I see it. I see it. I'm orientated.
Can't get up there. That's okay. Righto. And we drop down to whatever was down here. It's the other way in, so let's check it out. Dude, I hear people, eh? Yeah, there's like some maniacal laughing going on right here. See the, uh, we see it on the ground. Secretary, I'm on my way. It may take a while. These freaks are everywhere. Brent, I think I figured out a way to keep those freak, those effing freaks away. I soaked the floor outside of the control room and then electrified it with down, down power cable. It seems to be working. If you want to live, get your ass over here. Apparently that did not work. They found him anyway. He got in. I mean, I've got the, I've got the resistances. In fact, I've got, I've got some upgrades. I think. I've got two praxis, stealth hacking, sure. Confirm that. And then, really, what do I want to get? Don't need hacking analyzed. Don't need stealth advancer. Probably just like smart vision. Which is that too? See through walls, track threats through walls. I mean, that's just fun. It's not really useful, is it? But we'll probably get that next. What's this do? Gain information about nodes on the network before making a decision. I will save for the other one. So that's this room. Come around, so then we can go back that way. Yeah, we'll just leave this. I'm gonna die to a mine here. Checked out Celtic, the Celtic girls. It's Skyrim music, dude. It's friggin' legit. Uh, how do I get past here without dying? make a run for it. Right. Made a run for it. Worked. Ah, uh, yeah, I have, uh, I have, I have augmentations. Keeps me, keeps me nice and electric free.
Oh, that comes out here. Oh, and that way you can turn off the electricity. I get it. Okay. I, I'm actually just leaving it on. Yeah, I like... I, I earth myself, man. No, I'm, I'm actually just leaving it on because I don't want to, like... It, it, may, it doesn't hurt me, but it might hurt someone else, you know? Where's it at? I can hear it beeping. So we want to get in this room, check out what's there. Okay, moving them in the current apparently insta-breaks them. I did murder the box, but... Fuck, man. You guys did not make it out. They tried to barricade themselves in, but it just didn't work. This guy had the big gun. He's like, I'm, I'm locking down in here, but... They got to him. I feel like... Oh, here's the grenade launcher. He didn't pick up the grenade launcher. Okay, we don't need a grenade launcher. Uh, although we don't need... Uh... Actually, don't need that. Don't need that many of those. Clear up a little bit of space. Okay. We explored this area. You deserve that mine. Of the that was a concussion mine, so it didn't hurt me. There is another mine here, though. I'm trying to see. It's a blue one. Oh, I'm good. That that won't hurt me. They didn't hurt me. So that's where that guy was. Yeah. I thought I did, thought that might have been a um a red one for a second. Casual flashbang. Yeah. See, I've got I've got um resistances to flashbang, to uh, EMP, and to gas. I don't have resistance to frag grenades. The frag grenades is the one I don't have the any resistance to. But everything else, yeah. And then we're back out back out here so we've done the we've done the full circuit now we went in up there and then we've cleared all that we've come down back underneath and we're to here okay so that's fine so we now we can go forward no resistance to boomstick that's right there is no resist there's no there's no counter can't counter the boomstick there okay to the elevator I feel like we're gonna meet resistance I think this is just like just uh, what's it called like just initializing you to the what's happening here <laughs> no no we're gonna I'm not doing that anytime ever Not even on your birthday? You can do it on your birthday. <laughs> I'm not doing it. And we are going a long way up. back to 100 health why are we back on 100 health give me the painkillers use use 
is is all right the fuck on the other side we just go around we'll go to that middle room again in a sec and see someone on the radar I want to clear them before we start looking around oh okay even in here it wasn't safe Doug, I'm witnessing the most disturbing things I've ever seen. Something terrible is happening. A penche is erupting in complete mayhem. Augmented workers are running amok, writhing in pain and senselessly attacking everyone in their path. I do not know what is going on, but it appears that augments are turning against them. I can see several afflicted people nearby. Soldiers, I think. From the... Yeah. From the... About as far as... The fuck? And drop down here? It's like someone's talking to themselves in there. Boxes, a lot of them. Yeah. Elevator. Elevator was, was the go, man. Okay, so we got one there. That, I mean, we got to go back down, right? Because we saw where, where we... So we got to go up and then back down. Sort of get the feeling, yeah, this is going to become crowded very soon. Once. Okay, okay, I hear you. Be quiet! I can't think with all that noise! Come on, talking themselves in there. This can't go on. I can't take much more of this! I don't know if they're sane or if they're not. I mean, we're about to find out. Because, yeah, it looks like we're going straight into them. I think not sane. I don't know. He's barricaded in. Maybe. Yeah, well, I mean, you'd go cuckoo as well, wouldn't you? Definitely not good. Okay, okay. I, need a plan. Plan. When, when, I can't talk to him, so it's a it's a definite no. And then I'll be able to get him out because I I I I don't want it. Crazy worker, yeah. That's uh. We're gonna be in. in I think there's gonna be a lot of those. Dead person, grenade launcher ammo. There's a lot of grenade launcher ammo. That's that's somewhat telling in itself. Uh, <laughs> the duration of the summit, the door code to Miss Trudeau's temporary dressing room will be 8024. At least try to explain to both the Prime Minister and his wife that Penjay is still under construction. Yeah, well, a little bit more than that, isn't it? That's the same... Yeah, that's the same message. So that's the same message as we've read. There's nothing else in here. Apart from some laser ammunition, cyber boost energy, that's more what I'm interested in. Or plasma. Yeah, man. I think there's no coming back from this for these people, man. I think I've made the decision that um, there's... Maybe these people don't want to live, you know? After, maybe after what they've done, they, they don't want to do go on living. Um, so, I mean, I was sort of making that decision for them, but yeah, you sort of, you catch my drift. You know, probably wouldn't want to live with the guilt. But I'm just I'm just assisting them, uh, just assisting them with their decision.
Oh, shit. Uh, that's where we're going, by the way. That's where you said we're going down. We have to go down to the ocean floor to shut off the transmission. But we've got to go up first. Go up to go down. The old classic. Fuck, where's the map? I need a map. Okay, so we got... We just come around here. So we got toilets either side, and then we got stairs. Fuck, man. Is there, like, blood everywhere? I mean, let's... <sighs> Just, uh, relieve ourselves. Make sure you wash your hands. Always important to wash your hands. Okay. I don't know why I'm still getting money. Am I able to spend this money on something? I, I doubt there's going to be a shop. Is there a shop somewhere I can spend this money? Why am I still getting credits? Like, the fact that I'm still getting credits sort of tells me that there must be a shop somewhere. Are you a pants dryer? No. No, I, I use the, I use the, uh, either the, what was it, like the zzzz, or the, the hand, the hand towels, the hand towels. Oh, nice. I mean, if I was super tryharding, I'd still be hacking all these to get XP, but we're, we're past that. We got plenty of augments. Got hyper stims. 50 health each. Ooh. I see it there. I see it there hiding. Did a little bit of hacking software. Do you have the TSS at home? No. <laughs> you think I'm rich? Uh, yeah. Let me, um, let me just point you to the, um, like, 1,500 subs that are here, you know, monthly, subscribing to my content. Uh. <laughs> even if I had the 50, I, even if I had 1,500 subs, I'm not even sure I'd have the zzz at home. That, that, that's a, does, does anyone have the zzz at home? Oh, and this is different. Automatically generate a message, in accordance with command. Initiate emergency lockdown procedures, yeah. Activate emergency alert. Secure class A control center rooms, all levels. Lock dedicated security terminals, all levels. Activate auto laser protection protocols, all levels. Activate robot patrol protocols, all levels. Prepare for full purge and breakdown. The promised land awaits. My goodness. Maybe in Australia. <laughs> Uh, so we have a vent here, so that's just gonna take us like up there somewhere, sure. I feel like some of these vents must be for the way back down because, you know, on the way up there hasn't been any resistance. Like, why have a vent here, right? Is this the one that's gonna drop down to the lower level? Be careful, yeah, I'm gonna drop down. Okay. Comes into this room. Room I couldn't get into. Sure. Oh, we see something. Cooling system. Dude, I'm still too hot. I <laughs> don't like to assume, except that my Dota team's a dog. <laughs> this is. I mean, you haven't played in Australia, so you don't know. But I, I, I get the impression that European Dota is, is much better than Australian Dota. I'm still too hot, man. The cooling system, there's another cooling system for me. It's it's literally saying you're too hot. Cool down. What? This looks like a case I can open. I can't interact with it. Okay. So what room was that? Was that... This room over here? Oh, that was this room. Okay, cool. Got it. Got it. Got it. Got it. Got it. Ah, uh, bullets. <laughs> yeah, there's a turret there, lads. Archon EU equals Divine Australian. Uh, let's let's not get carried away, Vodka. 
Let's not get carried away. But I mean, I certainly think that it's uh, it's not not that far off. But I think it's certainly there is a there is an element of that. I mean plasma capsule. I guess if you if you're carrying the plasma gun at this point, then you need ammunition for it, right? If you have a new gun, you do need ammunition. That makes sense. Ugh. The gun away so don't shoot something. The destroyer of boxes. The destroyer of worlds. I knew it. We were as good. Yeah, yeah, yeah I know. Who would have seen that coming? I really just tack into this this um. This right, this what? This turret. Access grant. I can just turn it off. If I turn it off, I don't get to. I don't get the. I get the, the, uh, hey, your lifeline, not those boxes, they're not. I wonder if one of these will get it, if we're, yeah. hacking, hacking it was just a little too easy, you know? Looks like we're at the command tower. Could have protected you. Yeah, no, not those boxes. Those boxes don't protect anything. Dude, this has been a massacre in here. The, the turret just switched on and, and killed everything. Oh, cutscene. Yeah, I could I could put it on myself. That's cheating. That's cheating. That's cheating. We want to deal with ourselves. I don't think you want to do that, Mr. Jensen. Disengage lockdown, and whatever demons this station contains are likely to come crashing out on us. Afraid to die, Darrow? Or just unwilling to face what you've done? Oh, I know what I've done. Believe me. I take no pleasure in it. And yet you still did it. I did what had to be done. Twenty years ago, I gave the world augmentation technology. I thought I was giving it a bright future, but instead I gave it the means to destroy itself. No law, no UN regulation was going to fix that. People are dying out there. Hundreds of thousands of people driven to the brink of insanity because of you. I had to convince the world. Before today, people believed we should steal fire from the gods and redesign human nature. But human nature is the only thing we have that gives us a moral compass and the social skills we need to live in peace. Destroy it, and you destroy our very species. Don't paint yourself a savior in this. What you're doing is insane. Is it? When this is done, the Illuminati won't be able to control men and women like you as they had planned from the inside out. No one will be able to use the technology I invented to make others into beings they desire. Something we both know has happened already. You think you're Frankenstein? Killing his own monster? Actually, Mr. Jensen, I prefer to think of myself as Daedalus, watching helplessly as his child crashes into the sea. I'm ending this. Now. You can't. The signal is being generated from the broadcast center at the base of this facility. Pancea's security system has been programmed to protect it. 
And we'll kill you before you even get Oh, killed. I doubt it. You designed that system, Darrow. You can tell me how to shut it down. But I won't. Beta? You think what I'm doing is extreme. You simply don't you understand. Other people be points carrying emotion. For humanity to survive that beyond this century, maybe you must abandon ill his arguments are proven wrong. transcendence. And easily convert people whose cause is not used to resistance. But for that to happen, so resist him. The hard lesson must be learned. Blood is not used to being disagreed be with. Critique. Ah, uh, this is my my uh, my. Uh, I've got all my I've got all my orgs back, dude. I've got all my orgs back. This is my, uh, my, my tech, one of my techs. What you're doing is horrific. It has to stop. You can't force people to change. They have to do it on their own or they'll end up resenting you for it. And doing it like this? My God, Darrow, it's insane. It is not insane, Mr. Jensen. Tragic, yes. Unavoidable, no. Even as I listen to your words, I realize a cruel truth. No one else has the vision to see what I've seen. The will to do what I have done. You're all too weak. Judging, but never acting. None of you have the moral courage to see this through to its conclusion. Well, so be it. Maybe to stabilize if his arguments are proven wrong. Maybe you're right. Maybe you're wrong. None of it matters, because this is what will happen now. After today, whatever you say will be dismissed as the ravings of a mass murderer. You were one of the greatest minds of our time, and tomorrow you'll be nothing but a killer. But... but they can't think that. They'll be missing the point. Oh, why did I expect this to turn out differently? People like you. People who willingly surrender their humanity a piece at a time. You'll never understand. And browbeating won't get me to change my mind. You can talk and talk and talk, but in the end you'll still fail to grasp the fundamental underlying truth. Yeah? I don't... Omega? Pressure. Yeah, that's what we want to do, we want to pressure him. You know, I've always wondered about that leg brace of yours. Why the father of augmentation doesn't have the most basic of implants. Doesn't make much sense, really. Unless he's one of the few people genetically incompatible with this technology. <laughs> Gotta love the irony in that. It's the kind of irony that can tear you up inside, bit by bit, every day, until you find yourself despising what you're not. How dare you? You think I've done all this because... because a fluke of nature robbed me of my chance to become a part of it? I tried everything, damn you! Everything I could think of to change! None of it worked! None of it! So you had to fix it, didn't you? Take back control, make it like it never was. Yes! Yes, that's exactly what I... What I... I... What have I done? Give me the code, Daryl. Help me stop this. You'll still be in danger. Panchea's security system. Much of it is self-determining. And lethal. But if you succeed, if these codes help you turn off the system and reach the broadcast center, tell the world exactly why I did it. Explain to them about the Illuminati, the biochip, Panchea. Help them understand that the technology I created will not be a future any one of us desires. Silver Tongue? Feels good, man. And still talk to him. We will do that. I've got the I've got the codes. Just checking to see if there's any of these people that have anything on them. 
Nothing around here. Ever the augmented boy tells the world you don't want to be like me. Yeah, that doesn't seem like, um, that doesn't seem like, uh, the, what we want to do, does it? Did I, did I get them? Or am I missing them somewhere? Quest? Yeah, two zero one two. He's throwing it. I think I've got it. I think I've got it. All right. So, I don't need, oh sh. Okay, I didn't actually hurt me. I'm good. The code should help you shut down the Hyron project. The Hyron project. We know all about that. When you see it, you will understand. There is no room for this technology in the world. Yeah, the Hyron project me keep you. is Use the codes and is the one that they the were signal. testing all the when girls for. The the world, they were replacing their spines, hands. doing like spinal implants on them and hooking them up to a machine. Use the codes and shut down yeah. the signal. We, when you do the certainly the world will be in your hands. that was where we rescued everyone from at that bell tower base. All right, where's the where's the button? We gotta. Did we turn it off? Barry signal is being generated from the base of the station. Now that lockdown... Oh, lockdown has been disengaged. I need to send through the station until I reach the broadcast center. Okay. The lockdown has been disengaged. That means that all the crazies... All the crazies are out. Oh, shit. You look at my minimap. Richard, the lockdown's disengaged. I'm heading back to the hangar to see if those blast doors are open. Have you been able to raise anyone? I'm picking up several glimmers, but there's too much interference. I... I think you're... on your own, Jensen. Careful there, Francis. You almost sound like you regret that. Ah, look, there's no one here. They're all underneath. Now they're all on my level. Alright, let's go. We're built for this. I kind of feel like I want the the gun, the other gun. This one's good. This has a fast fire, right? All right. I'm stuck. Why was I stuck? I was like stuck. I couldn't move. I think I was like glitched somewhere. I was gonna try and cue them, but they uh. Oh, show them anyway. Fine. They're always hiding when I need to see them. He was like holding you? Yeah, I think he was holding me. He couldn't let me get away. Okay, so if they get me, they can hold me. That's that's a point I need to know. I gas those lads, there you go. Is that what you wanted?
These guys are sleeping. They had a little, little gas grenade to the... To the face. Now, there was this over here. I want to use this. Um, just drop that for a second. Okay. So we're going back down now. <laughs> we're going down. Oh, shit. Uh, I don't want that on four. Bloody hell. On four. Uh. <laughs> Let's pull out the <laughs> pull out the assault rifle. It's not too bad. We'll save the assault rifle for. I mean, we're almost out of pistol ammunition. Actually, let's use a little bit. If we reaction from a guy that's going down, <laughs> just pulls out the bigger gun. Those lads definitely behind that. That's where they're at. But they're on the same level as me. They're on the other side. Have all the vents? Yeah, I, I don't need vents. V vents, vents are for pussies. Uh, they like run immediately. Right. If you have to do it, then I have to do something as well. I'm sorry, man. Access granted, lockdown disengaged. He, he was relieved, man. I'm telling you. He, he was relieved that he died. He was like, oh, sweet relief. That was that was how it went, man. Oh, shit. They see me. Can I not get past that? So I'm safe here. Alive? Please have some ammunition on you. Yeah, that's what I'm. I'm looking for. Brett, why am I still getting money? Surely, am I getting to spend this money somewhere? Okay, so this is where I got to before it was locked down. Right. Attitude problem. I can't believe you said that lunch day, Henry. Global warming is no joke. Most of the people in the station come here because we know our planet is in immediate danger and our responsibility to do something about it. He did come for the paycheck. Got a safety hazard over here, guys. <laughs> yeah. 
<laughs> it was safety hazard. Yeah, there's definitely a safety hazard in here right now. I'm like literally just outside that door. funny. A little bit. Nothing here. Let's move on. Hold. Yes. Get the shields out. We're holding. Guy maybe hasn't completely lost his mind. Do we, do we want to let, leave him alive? We'll leave him alive. There you go. He was by himself. Maybe he wasn't muttering. Maybe he was. He's not too far gone. He can. He can come back. You know. We're getting money. Kid you not, if I don't get to spend money somewhere, I do not understand why we keep, keep giving money. Okay. Pistol ammunition? Any pistol ammunition? Where's that at? Another ho a whole row of nothing. It's fun to be rich, but you know how rich I am? I get 36,000 credits. I'm, I am incredibly rich. If I could buy something, I would. Uh, we, should, we just came from that way, didn't we? Yeah. Oh, hang on. Oh, I can buy something. <sighs> There's a limb clinic here. It's blockaded up. This person's still alive. Clearly, limb clinics are good, good security, man. Like, this is Greta... Goethe. Goethe Mueller? Goethe Mueller is just the absolute, uh... Just Giga Chad. Absolute giga chat. First person I've found alive who isn't uh, isn't crazy. Money even. 250 credits just lying down there. Hauling. I want love. Nice. Nice. See the wind turn the rudder. Okay. Go okay, down there. There's a computer here though. TYM biochip? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, there was nothing wrong with that, right? <laughs> right. Alright. Goethe. You seem relatively normal. Nishbar? All things considered, yeah. You okay? Thankfully, I was able to barricade myself in here when things got out of control. So, is it safe to come out now? No. The rest of the station is still under siege. You better stay here until help comes. In the meantime, 
Is it possible to download Praxis software here? It better be. Yes, of course. Yeah. No damage was done. Of course, no damage was done to the computers. See for yourself. Yes. No. No. Yes. Yes. I'll, I'll have a look. Thanks. All right. Your Praxis. Thank you. Your hyperstims. I can't fit those in. I don't think. Actually, I can. I will remain here, where it's safe. If you need help, or get word of help, please come back. Yeah, I really doubt that's going to do anything. Going back, but let's have a look. Nice, we're, we're stocked up. Got some got some goods. Got some goods. Uh, Praxis points, though. We got four Praxis points. I mean, what do we even want to get? Um, This is just annoying. We don't want that. Um, let's just get the Hacking Analyze add-on. That'll actually just do something. Oh, you can only buy two. There's a, there's a max two. Yeah. So yeah, that's what I'm saying. I've got all this money, but I can't buy more. I can I buy a max of two, yeah. Not getting, Stealth Enhancer is rubbish, right? Yeah, I don't need to track people. People don't stay alive that long to need to be tracked. Um... Let's just get this one. It's it's fun. See through walls. Alright. I think that's F3, right? Yeah. Okay. No, not to be confused with F2, which will blow up everything in a square square you know, ten meter radius around me. Let's go. This is William Taggart. If anyone out there is listening, Taggart? I'm begging you help. We've barricaded ourselves inside the core server room. Many of us are wounded. Please save us. Please save us. And S F five to save. Yeah, that's right. So, uh, If we can use this, use this F3 here. You can sort of see people over there. Very, very distant. Like we have like a... We're going outside for a little bit here. Actual some long range stuff. Let's pull out the... Let's pull out the goods. Um, pull out the goods. They're going to come at me too quickly for this, aren't they? Not really that long range. Maybe the tranquilizer is better. I won't alert them as easily. Are you gonna wake them up? Nah, surely they're not gonna wake them up, right? They're coming now. Sorry, lads. I was trying to trank you, but you, uh... What the fuck? How'd they see me? Ah, uh, by the way, let's, let's, uh... Let's use the Fletchit system. Oh no, they're going back, they're going back. Run. Lads, you don't have to.
Down, boys. And yet you keep trying. I, mean, I could. There's a very real possibility I run out of ammunition, right? Oh, sh shit. Uh, where did they come from? Was just enough bullets for them. <laughs> Holy shit! Alright, they're coming. They're coming hot and heavy. Right, we're down to <laughs> two and a half clips of assault rifle ammunition. Uh, that's certainly not good. Reload this thing. I need to use this some more. Did they come up from lower levels or something? Or Maybe. Maybe they ran up from a lower level. Possible. I was about to start hacking this before I turned and saw the, the, the mob just running at me. We are. We got an ammunition store. Right, give me a gas grenade. Is that just it? One gas grenade. This is some shotgun ammunition if you're using shotgun, but yeah, it's a nope. Get that back on here. Portable toilet, where his vodka has gone into. Gone to, uh, oh no, so he's going to get food this time. So we got a way forward here. Uh, we also have downstairs. So, so let's clear this level first and then, we, then we'll head down, I guess. full of crazies or a room full of, of normals? Room full of crazies. Uh, okay. Alright. Let's, let's do this. We're gonna get, we're gonna get, Nah, we get, we're gonna get up and close and personal here. Let's do it. Ready? Double. He 
need some more energy in a second. By the way, you missed the the zombie apocalypse when you were go 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 and get food. Um, I I poked my head out on that top section. I was about to start hacking something. I thought I'd better look back the down back like down the gangplank. I looked back down and there was like 15, 16 of them just running at me. <laughs> just charging at me. And I freaking pulled out the assault rifle and I'm just going. I've burnt through like a hundred a hundred bullets as they're as they're running at me. <laughs> The last guy I killed was uh <laughs> was on like my last shots on the clip. <laughs> you saw it from afar? Yeah. This friggin' we're going we're going off. Hello, what do you got? Ah, that's what I'm looking for. The ammunition. Take that. Alright, so. Hello? What do we have here? Factory. Box. <laughs> nice. Get me a password. Missing home? Wow. These guys need to really, um. Up their password game. They need to up the password game. Oh, there's Taggart. Let's have some robots work for us, shall we? We'll turn them on for once. So, I mean, I can go which way here? It's just another way into the same room. Yeah. Mossing. I think we'll go with missing. You're on my side, aren't you? Yeah, I was going to say. Good. Like, so wasn't showing up as green. So I'm like, uh... Huh. You, with, you with me, bro? You with me? Yeah, yeah, you with me. Good to, good to see you with me here. Hey, champ. Yeah, thank you. You give right away. That's what, I'm, that's what I expect. Oh, something. Yeah. Bent. So, boxes. Because like, there's multiple ways to get into them. I think you can just sneak along and, and do the box route or you can turn the turn the robot on ice cream what ah, don't need that laser rifle battery nonsense Capsules. Oh, that's where the vent goes. Is that literally it. Give me, give me some points. Goes to there. Also go in. Ah, uh -huh. something else. Hey lads, how you going? Do I drop by? Get it? Drop by. By the way, this is no longer a safe place for you to stay. <laughs> yeah, I'm a funny boy, I know. Yeah, I'm just let me just open up all the doors. Make sure I banged a hole in the wall. Open up the vents. How did you manage to avoid being affected by the signal? Were you in on it with that bastard, Darrow? 
You wanna say that again, bro? You wanna say that again? Put it away, man. Put it away, man. How did you manage to avoid being affected by the signal? Were you in on it with that bastard, Darrow? Bro, I've been trying to stop it. Get away! Just get away! I saw what you people did. You killed them all! You even killed each other! Do I look crazy? Do I look like they I'm in here killing you? On their knees, crying for mercy. And they were all murdered by you augmented monsters! Just go! I mean, to be fair, massacre. to be fair, these they guys are the anti-augment, the yeah, anti-augment team. And they were all murdered by and Hugh Darrow was a monster. Just go. Such a tragedy. And the right hands this technology could have helped so many people. If I hadn't made up my mind long ago, this would prove to me that you seem to be unaffected be by the controls. signal that Darrow is broadcasting. I suppose that is a military adaptation. We've dabbled in something we shouldn't have. And look at the result. Control. Senator, come on. Taking care of our girls. Look, guys, I know it makes some of you squeamish, but we have a responsibility to these girls. They are sacrificing everything to make sure this station is safe and secure. Need to remind you what could happen if one of one tiny crack in the outer structure goes undetected? I'm not asking you to sit in there and talk to them, but I'm asking you to make sure the nutrient lines are filled and no contaminants are getting in. And it's perfectly safe to open the pot every once in a while to check for heat, heart rate and pulse fluctuations manually. Just remember to use the associated security hub for each pod to open and then close it after you're done. Yeah, the, the Hyron project. Righto, righto Mr. Taggart, what do you got to say? What do you got to say? Mr. Jensen. How ironic that you should be the one to save us from the monsters out there. Monsters, Taggart? You mean people. Augmented people who've lost all control, lost their reason. Isn't that supposed to be my line? Unfortunately, it seems your esteemed Mr. Darrow decided to appropriate my point and turn it back on me. In madness and in blood. He has betrayed us all. So you finally admit it. You are part of this, after all. You have been all along. It would be pointless to deny anything now, but despite what you think of us, we never wanted augmentations outlawed. All we've ever sought is regulation, rules governing how the technology is developed, and laws that ensure it's used for the good of society. You've raised society above humanity. So who gets to make those rules? Men with wisdom. Strength and tenacity to know what's right. The Illuminati. Proven leaders who distinguish themselves, like, like you, Mr. Jensen. You certainly oh, earned the right to, to be one of us. Are you trying to give me a sales All pitch? All you have to do is take it. I'm not looking for glory, Taggart. Just remember that without control, there's no room for freedom. Only anarchy. You were a policeman once. You know the importance Dude, of order. You really trying to I sell me to the Illuminati right now? Order and slavery. The biochip wasn't supposed to force people to do anything. It merely limited power so that people couldn't go on killing sprees like the ones taking place right now. Amazing how well that worked. <laughs> Say what you want. But I know that some part of you agrees with me. Absolute freedom is no different than absolute chaos. Society needs boundaries if it has any hope of surviving. And you, Mr. Jensen, can be the one to give us that hope. Shut down Darrow's signal. Then help me get a message out saying that an accident at VersaLife contaminated the world's neuropazine supply. Uh. VersaLife? And what if I decided to blame the Illuminati? The Illuminati is just a name to get rich financiers to invest more money. Besides, do you really think the world will believe in some 18th century conspiracy theory? Do this for us, and you'll ensure a future for mankind, all of mankind, augmented or otherwise. The future Hugh Darrow offers doesn't allow for both. Let me think about it. Getting things done took Derek. Yeah, tag it. So I gotta make a decision. I'll be, I'll be sending a message out. Who will I be sending it to? All of this is as much your fault as it is Darrow's. You and your cabal. Perhaps. But all we sought was a safety valve, Mr. Jensen. A means of making sure the world would never spin out of control. The potential of this technology is great, but as we've seen, its potential for destruction is even greater. Your doomsday scenario doesn't impress me. 
You'd say anything to stay in power. Do you think humanity will simply police itself? We do not live in some Eden, Mr. Jensen. Or are you that much like your boss, David Seraph, who envisions a world where everyone is enhanced and suddenly they all love each other? There will always be a need for methods I'm not listen to a businessman. And conveniently, in your future, the Illuminati will hold the reins. Not directly. There are organizations already in place that are better equipped to handle certain things. The UN, for instance. Yeah, which you've got the no reimagined, no doubt. Yeah, which you've got the reins on. And this technology At least somewhat. Will be a great <laughs> part of it. Imagine, Mr. Jensen, a world governed by common principles. The end to international power struggles, to terrorism. These things can be accomplished if you join us. Got anything else to say? Stop the signal broadcast and get the word out, Mr. Jensen. Remember, Darrow's vision would set us back for centuries. So at the moment, I've got the choice of tell the truth or tell a lie and have the Illuminati in power. Okay. So there, there are two options for the time being. Now, you're going to keep them safe down here, aren't you, Mr. Robot? You good? Yep. Okay, that was a bit disrespectful, turning around on me like that. I was about to shake your hand, but sure. I could just throw an MP grenade at you and be done with you. Eh? Uh, eh? Uh, eh? Uh. You just watch yourself. You watch it. Check it. Check it. Sent plenty of your other friends to the trash heap. Okay. So we're heading down. You're treating your robot poorly. He feels bad, man. Hey, he, he disrespected me. He turned his back on me, man. We go down again. So we can go a lot further down than what the um, primary objective is. He's a robot. Hey, dude. Robots, they, they think, man. They know what's up. Ooh. Hold up. This level now. Uh, the fuck? That's an elevator. Okay, so that does look like the way forward. There are multiple elevators. Kiss my vacuum robot, Clyde. Good night, every night. My goodness. Uh, that's the sort of stuff you don't share, man. It's the sort of stuff you don't share. Oh, it's just open. Let me in here. What do we got? Shotgun. Money? Oh, poggers. More money, so I can go back and buy nothing else. I bought it all. Oh, ammunition. Actually, like... 10, 10, 10 bullets? I mean, that's like, what? Two and a half, two and a half lads. Maybe three if I use the bullets well. You can donate it to the unaugmented. I wish I could, man. I wish I could. You ready, robot? What have we got here? It's, it's behind a, a wall, so surely it's good, right? Access granted. Perhaps it's an ending choice. Donate money to donate money to the unaugmented. Yep, nice. Another plasma. I don't want the plasma, dude. No matter how much you say, get the plasma rifle. I'm just not interested. I'm not interested. It's like, I, I, I you cannot persuade me to get it. It's not as good as what I have. 
It takes up way too much space. Okay, so we've cleared sort of like this area. One, two, three, four, right? We had four. We had four, can, four areas. One of, oh, one of them was the robot area. Yeah, okay. Can't open that, no. Not without a computer to open it. But that's the way forward it, it, it would appear. That is, that is, yeah, that's definitely a way forward. So we're gonna avoid that for now. Uh, and we'll keep going down this exterior bit. Save 43 children living a life unaugmented male. Yeah. A hydrate, 10 or 12, will do. Will do. Let me just make sure I've got my gun ready. It'll be a feel good moment, man. It'll be a feel good moment. Where's my painkillers? Use these. Where's the damn, like... Where's down? Where's the down... I just jump down? Jumping down doesn't seem like a good idea. Is there really not ladders further down? I guess there's that elevator. And jump back up. Oh, you know we're going to do this. Oh, there's people at the bottom as well. Okay. All right, we're, we're going to go down there. We're, we're jumping down there. We're going to do the long, the long fall. Goes against all my natural... Oh, there's, a, there's, a, there's a ladder here. <laughs> Goes against all my natural instincts. Because it's not systematic. But, you know, we're going to, we're going to jump down there. Yeah, yeah. I, we're, we're jumping down there. Where we are gonna jump down. Just finishing this area. Yay. Dude, you couldn't you couldn't pay me not to jump down there. Um <laughs> We'll do our we'll do our, uh, our our concussion punch on the ground when we get down there. It's gonna be a long range concussion punch. Okay, it's gonna it's gonna be cool. Nothing down here? Okay, so We'll look at our map. So we've cleared this area. So we just haven't done this area here yet. We've cleared this. So we're going to jump down this hole. And I'm presuming that's going to drop us to here. And then that's that elevator. That's fine. That's this elevator here. So we'll be able to come back up. So we'll clear this area downstairs. In fact, we've got another downstairs underneath that as well. All right. So we're all good. You have enough power? I'm going I'm to power up before we go down. I'm going to power up. I'm going to power up some of these. Right. That should be enough. I've got I've got someone quick quick cast here. Um right. Let's do it. <laughs> here we go. Friggin Icarus landing system meets punch meets Titanfall or something. I think it's just click. Yeah. Left mouse to stun. Oh I'm winding it up! <laughs> You're talking about power. 
That's real power, son. Right there. That's real power. <laughs> That's cool. You know they did that. They're like, you know what? Let's put a really big jump and some guys at the bottom so they can, like, have some fun. This is like, this is just a fun moment. This is a fun moment. That's good shit. Alright. Wind it up. Alright, we got the... Is anybody there? Can you hear me? I've got Sarah. survivors here. We've locked ourselves in the machine room. Please! Help us! Find and speak with Seraph. Okay. We're gonna go talk to Seraph. Uh. Alright. They're, they're all crazies. Seem a little hyper. Yeah, they're not gonna be hyper for too long though. You feel me? The hell is this? Oh, we've now gone downstairs? This must be where they are. Okay. Well it's the brain, yeah, it's it's the best medication you could money can buy. It's cheap as as well. Um <laughs> Shit. Casual person just joins the stream at that moment. <laughs> yeah, bullet to the brain. Best medication money can buy. It's cheap as, you know. Was it 30 cents a bullet, you know? Um Right. Where's the That's what it's a bit like. I need for you to understand. Just let me explain. Just let me explain. Oh, it's a Seraph dude. Oh. I don't want to kill him. There's nowhere you can go. You should have stayed away. This is my boy. Can't kill a Seraph dude. That's my boy. That's who I work for. Like, that's my, my boss. I work for Sarah for Industries. That's... So this this is like... I'm, I'm the chief of security. So, like, this guy works for me. I can't, like, kill kill somebody who works for me. I put him to sleep. Here's your chance. Yeah, mate. Go to sleep. Go to sleep. We gotta use some different ammunition, so this is fine. Just using the trank darts. I mean, I'm happy to use them up. Come on. Come at me, bro. Through the water. I mean, your shoes are gonna get wet, man. You get cold feet. I need for you to understand! Just let me explain! Go to sleep. Come on. Come over. My chance, no. I can't. Hi. I'm leaving you alone. Have a sleep. Have a sleep. 
It's okay. Nice. Have a sleep. Come on, last one. Come take a sh come take a sleep with your li with your buddies. There is a boomstick if you remember. It's a long way back. Whoa, 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 whoa! What the fuck? They run side to side like that. Whoa, 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 whoa! Scratch my head. Scratch my head. Calm down. Calm down. Calm down. You're tranked. Just have a have a sleep. Have a sleep. Uh, no, you don't get any XP for killing these guys. See, there's no XP numbers popping up. There, there's no XP for getting him. So that's towards Saraf. We want to clear the rest of the path first before we go in there. So let's look. Literally right on top of someone? Quiet! I can't think with all that. There's nothing here. There's nothing here. Please, there's really nothing here. They said there were no rats here, but I knew there were. <laughs> They're everywhere! Go to sleep, champ. Wake up, it's... What the fuck? I promise. I, I won't hurt you. I just want to talk. Hey champ. It's in my head. I know it is. Uh, damn it. Did I get you? I don't think I did. Dude, go down. I, it, I don't know what that is, but it's being blocked. Uh, is that like... Is that the, the Hitler salute? Is that, is that what that is? Yeah, yeah, it's, it was blocked. There you go. I don't I don't I don't think so. I don't think it was intentional if that's if that's what happened. Alright. Did we use the rest of our trank darts? It's just me, mate. It's just me. It's just me. It's Adam. I'm, I'm looking after you, man. I think it's a good thing it's blocked. It looked like it when I was leaning back in my chair. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah. I, when, when it was blocked, I was like, uh, is that what I think it is? I sort of assumed. He hit his hand. Yeah. It's a strong, it's a strong tranquilizer dart, man. Um, let's just, let's ignore that his hand is, uh, is metal. It, it, um, <laughs> it, it nicked him. It nicked him elsewhere. Yeah, he's at the shoes. Welcome on in. Welcome in. We're having a wonderful day. Right, so I think we've cleared this room. Nothing up here. Nothing hidey hidey.
This bit, is this to the elevator? Okay, so that's the elevator. That's the way we're going back. That's fine. Okay, let's go back this way again. I think it's fine for us to safe for us to go talk to Saraf now. Ammunition, yes, please. Oh, we're we we're, we're, we're low. Any resources at the moment is good. Any resources, good resources. You all right? Feels good, man. Boxes are our friends. Is that your motto? It's vodka. Boxes are our friends. How do you feel about this? Bang. I know robots are our friend, but boxes it got the it got the workout. We're actually going to be annoyingly close to the end, but we're not going to get there tonight, I don't think. Um, it's almost like it's it'll be like a half a stream, probably when we uh, when we do this next. Because yeah, I don't think we're going to get there in like in in half an hour, forty minutes or so. I'm left in the stream. We'll probably clear clear these top areas, but not um, not further. Basically, it'd be just like the the very end game that we we won't get to. I don't think. Where are we? Okay. Prep for TI. FTL. There's a lot of things you can do. On the other hand. Um. I'm, I'm good for TI. That's starting Saturday. So that's starting Saturday. The, the streams will be starting, the casting streams are starting Saturday for TI. Um, no, that's all good. No, we'll keep going. We'll see how far we get today. No, we're not, we're not doing horror games. I mean, if you only play half a stream next time, you'll play Juice. Yeah, I'll, I'll do something else next time. I'll probably go over to Total War or something, but... Um, I'll, I'll, we'll keep going for now. We'll see how far we get. I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm in the groove at the moment, so... We're good to keep going. Why? Why would Hugh Darrow do such a thing? There's nothing to be gained by causing so much pain and terror. All those poor people. They must be so frightened. They must be so frightened. Yeah, so this is the different perspective. You're so hyped for TI. Dude, I am hyped for TI. Man, the the last chance qualifiers are like, are like a mini TI. So like Saturday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday is like a little friggin' mini TI. And and uh, and then we're actually going to have actual TI after it. It's insane. Yeah, it's it's actually poggers his back to the us. extreme this technology was his baby it was his passion that made me believe in its possibilities he's ruined it all the world will turn its back on I us so the industry will collapse and the world will be poor for the corner, it tearing at each other i just dropped to the floor and played dead good call one kept you alive the other one's arm off and beat him to death with it i thought for sure i was going to be next but he never noticed me Psst. tell me you're here to rescue us oh my god I had to crawl through the ventilation to avoid the carnage. It was... It was the scariest thing I've ever seen. Do I know you? You're Sarah's boy, aren't you? Jensen. So Sarah is just going to be concerned to about, like, um... Take charge here. Just about, like, his business, right? I can only imagine what's going on. He's going to be like, oh, no, my business. Gonna it's going to take a global plunge. You need to... You need to rescue augmentation technology. Make it look good. Oh, hello. Where's this Gekas? 
So I'm going to have a choice of join the Illuminati, tell the truth, or um, tell everyone that it was it was it's, it was all a joke. Um, <laughs> and Saf's business will be good. Any update on the Dodo drama though? Um, they did a not really. I don't think. I mean, there was something else. Again, uh, can I get like up here? I feel like there was something else in the last couple of days that I've forgotten about momentarily. Oh, actually, can I get up there? Maybe I can. I sort of feel like I can. Ooh, it's like really close. There is a big box outside. You make a you make a good point. The box man is on it. Oh, can't bring it in. Can't bring it. What if I stay on the other side? Like, ah, uh, hang, hang, hang on, I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. Ready? No. Eh. <laughs> Alright, we have the box in. Um, now, we need to like stand it up again. I don't know if it's going to help. I get, I take it all the way around the other side. I really don't want to take someone out. Kinda, kinda misclicked that then. Um, I don't know if you can actually get up there. I don't think you can. I don't think there's anything up there anyway. All right, let's talk to Saraf. Adam, oh, thank God you came. <laughs> get I've on the top of the ship. Here. We'll have to move them first. We can't move anyone yet. Not until I get to the base of the station and shut down Darrow's broadcast. What? Why? Why? The chaos you experienced here, it's everywhere. The Illuminati created a biochip that stops people from using enhanced abilities, and Darrow turned it into a kill switch. Oh my god, you... We gotta fix this, Adam. We gotta fix it. People yeah, make, this, make the company if they good. they augmentation technology yeah. created this chaos, they'll ban human enhancement research forever. And that would be a bad thing. Yes, it would! Don't you see what's at stake here? Ever since man first crawled out of that ocean, we've been striving to be more than we are. Augmentation technology is just the latest, greatest step on a very long road. But we've barely scratched the surface of its potential. We can't let fear stop us from continuing. That's your belief, Seraph. Not everyone shares it. But you do, Adam. I know it. I'm not going to try and get on top of the ship. together, we can really make a difference. We can improve the lives of everyone, but only if we fix this. Go on. We'd have to get a message out after you shut down Hugh's signal. Tell the world, tell them the Humanity Front did this. That their doctors created a virus that only affects augmented people. You mean lie. Uh, it'll give us time, son. Time to figure out how to destroy the Illuminati's biochips and move on. And what about the people who've been hurt by this? Don't they deserve the truth? I had them. If we want the freedom to become more than we are, we can't be blinded by a misguided morality. Some people will be left behind. It's reality. It's evolution, son. Right. Evolution I think this is the worst plan. Yeah. Please, son. Yeah. You have it to sounds stay like the worst plan, on doesn't this. it? I'll think about it. I'll think about it. I, I, I tell everyone with augmentation can get hacked. Yeah, like a virus just interrupted everything. You've got no remorse about using me at all, do you? I never used you, son. You experimented with my DNA without telling me. Ugh. <sighs> Adam, this is difficult. Listen, Megan, Megan came to me with the sample. When she showed me her finding, 
When I saw, when we saw the incredible potential of super compatibility. You just had to share it with the world. Adam, think about it. Would you have been able to you do any of the things you've done without Teslas enhancements? And other cars could get hacked and remotely huh? controlled. Most oh, people's yeah. bodies aren't as accepting of this technology as yours He just wants is. to keep his business going. That's Sharing why it's the most terrible, the worst plan. For us to be like you. The other plans are like, How can you, deny you know, like, chance? Who said I trying deny to set it? up a world order or, d or, or stop a world order. You didn't give me the choice. So, like, impact societal change, now. right? Look, I admit this is just I like, nah, I, I don't want my business way. to fail. But don't Tell anyone anything so we can still keep my business running. Daryl wants us to live in the dark ages. The Illuminati wants to limit evolution to those they control. You and me, we... Don't group me with you, Seraph. I'll make my own choices from here. I believe that, son. And I believe... you make the right ones. Uh, you believe we'll make the right ones. I know blaming humanity front leaves a sour taste in your mouth. But it's the only way out of this. So go. The longer that signal broadcasts, the harder it'll be to convince people. Think of it, son. A world where we determine our own path, where there's no limits to human achievement? How can you not want that? Hmm. No limits to human achievement. Uh, right. We're out. Got the... Hang on. Limited ammunition in the pistol at the moment. We did pick up some more tranquilizer darts. Um, so let's see if we can use those, because I'd prefer to keep the ammunition on the uh, on the assault rifle on the pistol. Uh, where am I going? Okay. Yeah. Although I don't like the idea of popping out of a door. Um, not armed. <laughs> yeah, have a tranquilizer. Go to sleep in a few seconds. <laughs> More boxes, man. Box City. Here we go. No limits except money. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> We jump. We jumped down this distance. Remember, we did the old. We did the old dive. We did the old punch on the ground. That was pretty poggers. I'm still excited about that. That was fun. That's anything on the radar. All right. So we've all we've done this whole area. So we've done everywhere. This is all cleared. It's all been cleared. Okay. Right. So we're heading heading this way. You're making those breathing sounds, man. Granted, it's a long, a long pathway to an elevator. My teeth look more yellow after the dentist than pre-dentist. Did they like put some like agent on it for the work you got done, or did they actually do a clean? Just because something, and they were supposed to clean, well, just because they're yellow doesn't mean they're not clean. I mean, they might not whiten them. There's a difference between cleaning them and whitening them, right? So, it's, did you get a clean and whiten, or did you just get a clean? Yeah, you know, yeah. We have breathing apparatus in this area, yeah? I'm going to plan on it. Oh, 
Lads, don't don't become overexcited. I'm doing what's best for you. Very good. Pretty sure I shot you. Got fucking immune or something? How many trank darts did this I uh, take? It was like three? Maybe they did hit the metal. Uh I'm definitely missed. One more in. I think it's gun time. <laughs> I just want to get as much value out of my out of my other ones as I could, right? Reload. Can't get collaterals. I mean, like, uh, shoot, like, shoot throughs. It, it packs a punch, the old sniper rifle. I think we got him. And I'm glad I, I got as much value out of my tranquilizer darts as I could. Um, because otherwise we would be short of ammunition. I mean, we did we did no scope him. It wasn't a 360 though. You saw he got pretty pretty pinched. He he, he sort of flew off his feet a little bit. Oh, I could have put a tyrant on. Yeah. Wearing gas masks is quite awful. Yeah, just get an augmentation so that you can just breathe toxic air, man. That's that's where it's at. So we could have just turn that turret on. It would just lit them all up. I mean, that would have been pretty fun as well. But I, I did enjoy the sniping. Is this? Was oh, there a turret at this end as well? Is a turret at each end? Oh, it just it would have lit them freaking. It would have lit them up from both ends. That would have been actually quite the show. Um, <laughs> boxes, okay. Friendly, friendly turret boys. Those guys are, are, they pack a punch. They are like high, I think they shoot like sniper rifle shots almost. Like that, like 50 cal. I think they're 50 cal um, shots on those turrets because they hurt. Like, legit, you can just insta-die from those hits pretty quickly. Okay. 50 cal tyrants. Look at them. I think they are. Look at this shit. Alright, let's let's get my, my 50 cal uh, single shots out. <laughs> my 50 cal single shots. Close range. This is this. Is, I got I got lasers. I got laser sight on it. So if I run around in COD for quick sniping with 50 cal. Look, I got laser sights on this baby. I'm I'm not afraid of close range. Don't know if I can go.
Meet my new pistol. It's a little larger than the other one. Like, like the knockback can break a shoulder. Yeah, but I've got I got metal shoulders, so you know, I'm, I'm all good. I think there's any up there. Alright. Laughing at COD 4 that I used to play, yeah. I'm good, yeah. Yeah, the knockback is, is, is a considerable issue in real life for a for a 50 cal. I've never fired a 50 cal, um, but I've fired other rifles that are nowhere even near that, and uh, yeah, it's it's pretty pretty powerful stuff, really. Guess we're going down. Down we go. Once the elevator ride begins, there is no turning back. Are you sure you want to send now? Let's just check. There's no. This is the point of no return. This is it. Darius' signal is being generated from the base of the station. Now it's locked down in there. Yeah, we're going down. We might finish today. Who knows? Maybe we'll go a little bit later and finish. We're going. This is it. Can I, can I unlock? Oh, I say lock you in so you can't jump off. Right. I get it. <laughs> Oh, we are we're going down we're going to the belly of the beast yeah that's 900 i think that's at max range right yeah it's not going past 900 meters so it's maxed out at night it's past a kilometer we've already gone down because that's maxed out at 900 meters yeah so 900 meters is maximum range and yeah we are well past that because that's 300 meters just there that's 400 meters Videos of people shooting pistols for the first time and dropping on the kickback is funny, yeah. You know, you, all you need to do is fire a pistol once and you know that what they do in the movies where they're just like, pew, 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 and you're like, yeah, that's absolute bullshit. <laughs> it's more like, pew! <laughs> you know, lock in, lock in, lock them in so it doesn't hit you in the freaking head, for starters. Um, most people get just get sort of smacked in the freaking face with, uh with the kickback. Uh, we are a long way down. We're at the ocean floor, I would suggest. Or close to it. Yeah, like that's 85 meters to that door and we were like past 900 meters in, in 10 seconds. So we were in like three seconds or something. We're way, way far down. Oh boy. That doesn't look like an endgame scenario, does it? <laughs> so much to explore. It doesn't look like much to explore at all. It's one corridor. One corridor going forward. In fact, let's let's do a proper save here. Um It's all creaking, man. It's all creaking. Do a proper save. Alright. And one giant round thing. I got my I got my 50 cal though, so I'm set. Anyone wanna go me? The reload speed is a little bit slow, but apart from that. I mean this doesn't look healthy. Energy, yes. Rifle. Plasma. Painkillers. Plasma. Okay, let's let's painkiller up then. Um, use and I guess one hyperstim. I guess we got plenty of them, so get up to two hundred. Uh, let's use this plus one of these. All right. <laughs> Three sixty no scope that shit. I don't... Okay. Uh... What grenades we got? We got three gas, one... Okay, but let's put on frags. Put on frags. Frags looks good. Oh, here we go. I, do, I feel what very bad. Hell? This is... This is the Hyron Project. We learn all about it.
God. Water pressure on 173 PSI. Who am I? Communications web online. I feel cold. Drones 1 through 3 within operational parameters. I don't remember. Drone 4 disconnected. Let me go. Processing. Oh God, please help me. I'm scared. Core temperature stable. Processing. Zhao, what are you doing? Connecting to Panchea's Harun project, Mr. Jensen. The most advanced quantum computer slave to the human brain, and the closest to perfection we'll ever achieve. I'm going to oh, use the signal and rework the message to our benefit. Our benefit? You mean the Illuminati's? Someone has to override the signal and be the world's savior. And let's be honest, neither of us would trust anyone else to fill that role. Computer, begin EEG sync. So much pain. Sinking beta waves at 40 cycles per second. Sleep, please. Let me sleep. Incompatible master slave. Incompatible master slave. Unable to transfer control to our heart. Uh, the system won't recognize my chip. Neural systems offline. Control of the I can't control Iron. Increasing glutamate losses by 32%. Zhao, get them out of there. I have to reach the control chamber. No! I can feel control! I feel control! Stop the signal! Security alert. Through the primary control panel. Oh shit. Like protected or some shit. No, protect mother. Stay away. Stay away. The fuck have I got to do? Shutting down Darius' signal. Darius said his signal was protected by the Hiram Project, a cutting edge security system. He didn't mention that the system is made of advanced quantum computers slaved to human drones. Zhao Yunru just hooked herself up to it, so if I want to shut down the signal, I'm going to have to defeat her. So, what the fuck does that involve? I got a plan. I'll do it, mother. Just don't hurt anymore. Just no more pain. Please keep it away from us. Security measures are sufficient. In sufficient. Once the weight of their gaze touches you, right. there is no oh, escape. This. Anything here? Nothing. Lead you to a hole miles deep in the ocean, about to meet your end. Okay, okay. Look at what they've done. I mean, I don't know what breaking these walls down are going to do, but maybe it just gives me a way to move around. I think is the most likely thing. Oh, there's no weak wall there? There's no weak wall. Okay, so we can move around. Do I need to shoot the girls? I really don't want to shoot the girls. Um, okay, I need to do some scouting. I 
have no choice but to eliminate you. You have won everything. I've been awake for so long. Tired. System monitors online constantly. There's too much to keep track of. Supplemental diagnostics required before we can sleep. Tayo will dominate the market. Sarah will no longer be a thorn in my side. I have energy. The results of the diagnostics are inconclusive. I feel bad. Vital signs. Vital signs normal? No. This is not normal. Okay. Oh, yeah. This is not to be normal. So there's a security panel down there. Can I destroy these turrets? Whoa! Bullet, the pistol has armor piercing rounds, so that's what I'm sort of thinking. Wow, it got angry. So I can get... I can, okay, I can't kill him. Okay, that's one down. One down. There's a panel down there. I wouldn't... I don't want to kill the girls if I can avoid it. Run that armor pissing rounds here, though. Too long then. <laughs> Reset and yeah, it's all on down. Hey, okay, turrets are down. That means I'm free to like move around, right? I have an eye sim. Um, I want. Where is it? This one? I'm there. Have some more energy. Are there are robots. There's someone in there. So we have a security panel here. Because the girls tried to help me and then they got like over overridden by the by the dude, by the chick.
Pod 2 safety purge in progress. Stand by. I'll open that door. Ah, oh, 2012, that was this one. Life support system? Hold up, hold up, do I have to kill him? I think I have to kill them. These are the, the women that was that were kidnapped. Do I actually have to kill them to defeat it? I mean, a bullet seems a bit callous. Is there really nowhere else I can go here? Defeat the Hiram Project. We broke down those walls. They didn't really give us anything. Another computer over here, right? So I turned this off as well. I didn't get the password for this one. I might have missed that somewhere. Access granted. Warning. Part one, safety purge in progress. Stand by. I mean, those turn their life support systems off? Is that less humane? More humane? Let's get out the... Let's get out the, the largest thing we have to a boomstick. Says, uh... Down the down. Keep the Primary pod compromised. Secondary security measures activated. Evacuate area. You still cannot reach me, Jensen. There are too many contingencies built into this system. You and I have both suffered. I don't think there's too many contingencies. I'm taking them down. 
Where are the contingencies at? No, no, now I can get her. Because there was a there was a wall here. No, I can't. I can't take Maybe you just need to sh shoot the woman was blocked. Oh my goodness. That's not good. Avert your eyes! Yeah. <laughs> Beat the Harem Project. Done. I mean, we are seriously low on resources. Uh... Grab those two. Another room over here. Yeah. I mean, we just shot those guys with the bloody with the sniper rifle. <laughs> it's just no. I was just laser sighting them. They were getting blasted. Okay. More sniper rifle ammo. Yes. 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 All right. So, we, we actually had to kill the girls? That feels bad, man. I didn't want to have to kill them. Turned off their life support. That seemed like the most humane thing to do. Oh, hello. Uh, hey, you like your toast burnt? You scrape it off with a knife? Uh... Yeah. That's... Not looking good. I can just walk through there. All right, so what we gotta do? No objectives. Just move forward, I guess. This is it. This is it. This is where we've come to. Hello, Adam. Oh, it's Welcome Eliza Kassan. It is not the end of the world. But you can see, you it, can from see it from here. Nice. Eliza. What are you doing here? It is my job to monitor and report on the news, Adam. Before Darrow smothered everything with his signal, the whole world was tuned into this place, including me. The broadcast. I have to stop it. I know. Please come closer. Do you know where we are, Adam? We are at the fulcrum point, when society lies in the balance. Hugh Darrow hoped to tip the scales one way, by telling the world everything you already know. About the biochip, the Illuminati, everything. He believed knowing the truth would convince mankind to abandon <laughs> research into human you enhancement You can do it, man. Just keep a calm head. You'll be fine. Forever. It would certainly give them reason to fear it. Indeed. Daryl's confession is ready to send. If you want, I can wideband it across all media as soon as you shut down the signal. Everything you worked so hard to uncover will be exposed. But only if you deactivate the broadcast using this control. However, 
If you desire, I can alter Darrow's message. Conceal the creation of the biochip while putting in new content. Content blaming the humanity front, like Sarah suggested. The organization has already admitted to harboring terrorists. It would be easy to convince people they turn to biological warfare in a more desperate attempt to get rid of augmented people. But why? What would that achieve? In time, it could shift the focus of hatred onto people whose prejudices are seen as too extreme, leaving corporations free to experiment with human evolution as they desire. But if you want me to perform this edit for you, you must disengage the signal and activate the video edit function from here. Alternatively, Darrow's message can be adjusted to erase all mention of the power group known as the Illuminati. I can report that lack of proper regulation allowed vast quantities of neuropazine to become contaminated prior to reaching the market. Taggart's preference. You think the world will buy a made-up story about neuropathy? I have my voice on as irrationally you lashing out, yeah. by what people believe. I can convince them. And having Almost comical in a way. negative effects of corporate negligence firsthand. Yeah. A majority of people might force the world to place harsh restrictions on all human enhancement research. But only if you disengage the signal and activate the video edit function from here. Of course, there, there is another option. option. This passage leads to Panchea's pressure regulation controls. Oh, Destroy them and the installation shit. will cave in on itself. Overwhelmed by the weight of the ocean pressing against it. Everyone inside the structure will die. That's a solution? No one will be left to tell the world what happened, Adam. Nobody will be able to spin the story. Including me. The choice is yours. Do you believe you have the wisdom to choose an appropriate future for mankind? Or do you trust mankind to find the answers on its own? Vodka. We can send Dara's message, tell the truth. We can send the biological warfare message, Humanity Front would did the dirty. We can send the Illuminati message. Or... We can go down this very ominous... Self-destruct button. Except if you choose Safari Man, then you're a negative IQ. That's Saraf, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's this one. Yeah. So do we want to... Do we want to let the Illuminati take the reins? Do we want to let the... Everything we've worked so hard to expose. All the work we've done. All the re Everything we've done in this game. To that information to get out. Or do we want to implode? And no one will know. No one will know anything. They'll have to figure it out themselves. Or do we want augmentation technology to continue or not? If we want it to continue, we go here. But with regulation. With regulation. Continue with regulation. Here is... It probably won't continue at all because the truth will be exposed. Here is... Sarah's message. Or do we want everyone to get the truth and make life augmented hard? Yeah. Or do we just give them nothing? Would you would you do the self boom? There's no out no way out. I know I I feel like you'd do the self boom. You'd be down here, you'd be just slamming this button, right? Just the old self boom. I feel like that's a waste. I feel like that's a waste. Can't see the boom. If we press the self boom, I feel like there'll be a boom. The self-destruct button, man. This is gonna whole place is gonna go. Oh, if you're dead, you can't see the boom happen. Hang on, do we have any? Do we have any? Did we get? We got one. We enhance.
I'm tempted to send the Illuminati message. Regulation. Regulation, but everyone still gets to live. So everyone can still continue, but there's just more more rules on it. You do you. I think truth. You want the truth to go out? Life's going to be hard for everyone. All the augmented are going to have a terrible life now. Shit. I mean, it doesn't make a difference. I, I still have... I'm definitely not doing this. Um... Regulations. <laughs> ah. I found the truth. Don't I want to share the truth with the world? Truth will set us free. If you do this, the unadulterated truth in Darrow's confession may well convince mankind to cast all science and technology aside, to ensure that future generations grow up free and whole. Are you sure this is your choice? I even get, I already pressed it once, they give me a second chance to back out, man. <laughs> hang on, hang on. Let me think about it. But what happens if you do this? First hand experience with corporate negligence on such a grand scale may convince mankind to enact harsh restrictions on human enhancement research. Are you sure this is your choice? Let me think about it. Unadulterated truth. If you do this. I think this is what we're going unadulterated for. Unadulterated truth in Darrow's confession may well convince mankind to cast all science and technology aside. To ensure that future generations... May well convince. May well convince. I don't think it will convince. Are you sure this is your choice? Let's do it. Yes. So be it then. Albert Einstein said, technological progress is like an axe in the hands of a pathological criminal. It took me a while, but I finally see his point. How often have we chased the dream of progress only to see it perverted? More often than not, haven't the machines we built to improve life shattered the lives of millions? And now we want to turn that dream on ourselves to fundamentally improve who we are. Experience has shown me how dangerous that can be. How many times in the call of duty did I almost fall into the trap of taking shortcuts, abusing my abilities or the resources at hand? I resisted, barely at times, because I valued human lives and considerations. Can I truly despise others who fall? Technology offers us strength. Strength enables dominance, and dominance paves the way for abuse. Darrow understood this. He knew that using technology to become something more than we are risks losing our ability to love, aspire, or make moral choices. The very things that make us human. It also risks giving some men the power to make others what they choose, regardless of the cost to human dignity. The suffering Darrow inflicted is not the end of the world. It is merely the seed for change. And change never comes without pain.
This is actually a thing discussed in a book called Emojis. Yeah. So I think you get a different um, ending dialogue depending on what option you choose. Pretty good. Pretty poggers ending, really. I mean, for a story that's like all. It's, it's it like. The whole game is about the story. Uh, there's more. It's Vodka. We gotta wait for the credits. <laughs> um, but for a game that's all about. I love the story. The story is just fantastic. Um. It's so good. And when you played the first game, I've said it so many times during this playthrough. When you played the first game and there's like all the nods to the story in the first game and you can see how the events of like 20 years prior to the, the first game are just leading up to that point. It's everything is just slowly dropping into place to get to the point of what where the story is in the first game. Um, and it's so good. It's so good. Yeah, the, th this is what sets this game apart. Like the writing in these stories is is the game. Like it's 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 a movie that you're experiencing with really good gameplay as well. Dude, I haven't even played Cyberpunk 2077, and from what I've heard, people are disappointed. This is this was made 12 years ago. This was made 12 years ago, man. Like 12 years ago, this was made. How good is this game? I think it was 2010. I'm pretty sure it was 2010 this came out. This, this is just a masterpiece. Like, when you put it, it it's so good. The the aesthetics of the game, they nailed it. The, the soundtrack is, is fantastic. It's just awesome. I love the soundtrack. Um, like, it's got the conspiracy levels going on, but it's got, like, the real human, like, suffering that occurs as well. Like, you see the, the people, the, just the ordinary people in the story that, um, that you experience the suffering of, of what they're having in, in this world, and it's, it just builds the world. Good stories are just good, they never become old. Oh, yeah. I'm telling you, the original Juice X, I'm gonna play it on stream at some point. Um, yeah, I mean, yeah, there's always going to be some janky mechanics. You can't get away from that. Um, so there's another game after this, which is Juice X Mankind Divided. Uh, and that's, that's featuring Adam Jensen as well. So the same character in this. Um, it's not as large a game. Um, uh, and I would say the storyline isn't as good, but it's still good. Um... So I'll be I'll when I when I get past TI, that's gonna be what's next. Will be Mankind Divided. Um And then after that will be the original. So they will play him in like chronological order, even though not in terms of when the games came out. So the last game we play will be the earliest one made. Uh in terms of graphics and stuff, will be obviously a bit of a shock. But the the storyline is amazing. Absolutely amazing the storyline in the in the first game. Better than this one. It's it's insane. It's incredible. I have not played Bioshock. I've heard I have heard it's good. The thing is time, and I, I only want to invest time in, in things that I I uh I and guarantee that I, I'm going to enjoy. Yeah, I don't know, man. I'm old. I'm old, you know. It's it's hard to do things. Just the, the prospect of picking up a game I haven't played that I'm not entirely sold on is is like... Is it... It's... 
not intimidating, but it's it's just draining. It's draining. Like for like, if Kingdom Come Two came out, I'd be on that in an instant. I'd be I'd be streaming that in an instant. Um, you know, and if a new Juice X came out, I'd be I'd be on that as well. Um, I don't know. It's like. I'm just old man. 29. <laughs> Bioshock 1 is best to be played on slightly easier difficulty and get pretty out of hand. <laughs> Dude, I don't do easy difficulty. You know that. I love how these these uh, I haven't mentioned it, but I love how these the words the letters are coming in here. It's it's cool. Just a little thing, but I think it's cool. I know, but it can take away from the experience and make it tedious. Oh yeah, I get that. I I just generally don't come across that many games that hard is hard. Like Northgard is probably the first game that extreme difficulty actually is freaking insane. Like. Extreme is extreme. Um, and that's killing me at the moment. That conquest mode at the moment is killing me. It's it's actually breaking my breaking my mind a little bit. Bioshock and hardest difficulty is like you can run out of bullets so easily and then you are just fucked. <laughs> Do you have any melee attacks? Do you have melee attacks in Bioshock? Is that a thing? You do? Feels good, man. Easy. Just level that up. Just just level up melee attacks. <laughs> so someone who's never played the game before. Doesn't work that well <laughs> that way. Uh whoops. If you really like a man. You played on stream. <laughs> There's nothing stopping you, man. Go ahead, play some uh, play some Bioshock on stream. If you enjoy it, go for it. Look how many people are involved in this, by the way. It's actually it's actually insane how many people are involved in this project. Bioshock. I've heard of Bioshock Infinite. Like, so much effort goes into a game like this. Just the, the pure amount of hours that would have been put into this game. Rory Smith, thank you, PR executive. Justin Gaffney, Anthony Newell, Danielle... Mousley, Leo, Leah Owens, Ian Rosell, Emmanuel Juan Afe, Philippe Cadu, something, Kingsley Lee, Sergio Olivia, Yannick Chesse, Paul Gordon, thank you, Paul Gordon, Joanne Tam, thank you for your for your assistant product product manager, uh, public relations director Sonia Im, thank you, thank you for your service. I don't enjoy the gameplay of Bioshock 1 enough to replay it. It's truly a masterpiece of a story. Beautiful. I wouldn't want to play it again yet. In the same way as I don't want to replay Witcher 3. Yeah. Special thanks. Special thanks. My Immortal. Gribba. Acid Burn. But they like playtesters. Here we go. Here we go. 
You worry too much, Morgan. There's nothing we can't manage given time. She's here. I have to cut this short. Keep going through the wreckage. Maybe we'll find something we can use for the Morpheus Initiative. Come in. Dr. Reed, we're so pleased you decided to join us. Where else could I go? No regrets, my dear. As Ariadne told Theseus before he entered the Minotaur's labyrinth, always forward, never left or right. You'll be very interested in our current project. We're breaking new ground. Yes, the nanite virus chimera is quite intriguing. I'm looking forward to seeing the hybrid project up close, Mr. Page. And so you shall. But please, call me Bob. <laughs> oh, it gives me spine tingles. I mean, maybe you have to play the original game to know, but it gives me spine tingles. And that's it. Do sex, human revolution, director's cut. He's done. Click, escape. Oh, yeah. Oh, resume. Is there more? Is there more? Do I just have to escape? It appears like there's nothing more. There it is. You've been watching over on YouTube. Uh, hope you've enjoyed the series. Be sure to like, subscribe, and comment. Um, I've certainly enjoyed playing this. Uh, it's been like, what, seven years, I think, since I've played this? Maybe more uh, since I've played it through. And uh, it's been it's been lots and lots of fun. It's been it's been an absolute ball. I've really enjoyed it. And the plan is after TI casting, we'll go to uh, Mankind Divided, which picks up the story with Adam Jensen. So uh, we'll see that. So as I said, if you're watching on YouTube, thank you for watching, and uh, I'll see you in uh, in the next video.